everybody, left to here. I'm coming at you today with Through the Woods. Yep, that's the game. Totally almost forgot the name of this game. Uh, yeah, it's been a while. Um, but the last time we left off, we finally got through the wolves and learned that stupid mechanic that took forever for me to figure out because I can't brain very well. And now we're going to have to deal with a witch. So let's see how great this one goes. I can't wait to see what happens here. So let's do it. All right, here we go. So we read this last time, but I think I got to read it again. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Yep, yep, we got it. Witch in the mire. I wonder if that actually told me what to do about her, but I'm an Jesus idiot. I forgot to actually reread it. So never mind. We're going to figure this one out. I think I'm not supposed to face her. I think that's what it was saying. Something like, if she sees you and stuff, you'll see, like, horrible things. So, just that fall. That fall is great. Stop, drop, and roll off the cliff. I got this. But I think I'm not supposed to look at her. I think that's what I was getting. Squeak, squonk. Okay. Why are you all squeak, squonking in here for? Oh, yeah, there's my flashlight. I've been wondering about that. Oh, boy, this looks beautiful. Can I just walk off this cliff, too? Oh, I'm sure I could, but I'd probably die, so I guess I gotta do this slowly. All right. As I run. Why are you gasping for? <laughs> Stuff is happening. Tis a sad thing about Jorn's daughter, but he gave her to Eric bravely, and was all proud of him. I saw him staring into the mire as if he had a mind to wander there again. We saw the light of Eric's torch returning from Vlhebe in the dim light this morn, safe for another handful of years, sent out our sorrows to him and Jorn too. So another year of deadness in Stolf. We did our duty, slaughtered children. Now we live good. Drink all the ale. I'm still not completely understanding. The fire was terrifying. Oh, excuse the me. Thought that Espinar was that place made my bones you. cold. I missed him. But it's his dad. The marsh sucked all the emotion out of me. I was haunted, hounded by a hopelessness I didn't understand. I forgot Espen's face. I forgot my own. I sometimes wish I could forget it all again. You forgot your own face. What is there like? You got a no brain to remember what it looks like? Mm, I see that saving stone. I know what's going to happen. I'm going to die. Oh! oh, no, no, no. Oh, I see you. You look all sloppy and stuff. <gasps> that didn't sound good. Whoop, oh, that didn't sound good at all. Nope, 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 just running, just running. Nope, 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 nope. Whoop, no, no, oh no, there's more of them. Oh, no, 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 no. Nope, nope, uh, nope, the big old nope on that one, can I go around a rock, lady, you won't climb stuff, you won't jump, where am I supposed to go, where am I supposed to go, what am I supposed to do, okay, I guess I'll go this way, blah, 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 to you too, good sir, I'm off on my own adventure, you have fun, blah, 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 and up over there, all right, where do I go? Okay, I think I go this way. He doesn't seem interested in me, so I'm okay. I think. Probably gonna die. That's what's probably gonna happen. I thought that was a person. That was a bush. Ooh, but that's a person. Ooh, I almost missed that guy. Ho oh, ho, hi, how are you? You having a good time over there? That's another bush. All these bushes keep glip glopping in my view and freaking me out. Oh, good. Another save point. <gasps> oh, you just go whisper bye bye that way. Okay, bye. 
Am I supposed to go in here? Is this a bad idea? It sounds like... It sounds like a bad idea! Oh, I don't think I'm supposed to go in here! Oh, messed up! Get out, 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 get out! Get out, you dumb woman, go, go! Human, help me! Human, help me? Shit. Hello? Human, oh my god! I have waited. My mistress. What? Oh wow, he looks cool! I'll come to you, what up? Jesus. What are you? How are you still alive? There is nothing left of you. I am Garm. Guardian of the gates. Guardian of hell. The veiled lady. I was those things. Too old. Too weak. Unimportant. Help me. Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna help you. You look awesome. Is Hale? Are you really saying Hale is out here somewhere? I don't know how I can help you. I'm supposed to go put a vow on her. Suffering. My despair. Oh, but why do I have to kill him? You want me to kill you? I can't do that. The rock above. The spire. Bring it down upon me. Please. Okay. Well, if I do that, do you get like a revive option? Oh, I'm trying to move around your feet. Your feet are all in my path, dude. Oh. I want to help, but I don't want to help. How do I get up there? Seriously, how do I do that? I'm, I'm a little confused. I'm a little confused. How do I how do I do this? Uh, do I have to Oh, please don't tell me I got to go around some weird old way. Ugh. You gotta go past the witchy woo. She's gonna be making murderous faces at you. Okay, yep, here it is. Thank you, God. I feel so dead. Oh, he was a good dog. Oh, good boy! Oh, I feel horrible. I just put down the big old dog. I wish I had him as a pet. See, now I'm sad. A game that makes you kill a dog. Worst game ever. Immediate. Same thing with movies. The movie makes you kill the dog. Worst movie ever. Just gotta... Yep, nope, he's dead. <laughs> just go check to make sure that he's dead. Yep, dead. Okay. Should I be walking on the, 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 the thingy with the lamps? Yes, I am. Hopefully she won't try to eat me. Oh, I heard it. Singing. The witch. Oh, yep. That sounds bad. Am I supposed to avoid her? Mom, I want this one. You have one just like it at home. All right, she's going to make Come me on. see my... Mom, I want this. Don't look at the stuff. It's been... You're not having it. Let's go. Don't look. I want it, Mom. No. Come here. Mom. Oh, Mom. Jesus, what did you do? I smacked him. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, Espen. I beat the crap out of him. He kept whining about oh, wanting stuff. Please. Why are you doing this? I didn't mean it. Am I supposed to walk on that? I don't know if I trust that. Okay, it's gone. So I guess I can now. Do I sit here? Do tell them what happened. Oh yeah, I guess so. For God's sake, if we tell them what I did, I'll lose the firm. They'll take Espen away. We what did you do? To. It's the right thing to do. Was I beating my child? Say anything. Uh, it was an accident. I didn't mean it. I know. I know. It, it just feels wrong. What yeah. feels wrong? But, Having okay, beat my child? Let's just get through it together, okay? Stop! Please! I didn't mean it! You didn't mean Don't what? Don't me anymore! Hitting him? I'm not understanding the I didn't mean stuff. Want a what? A divorce, goddammit! I want a divorce! Okay, I want to divorce you. 
time. You're welcome to one, but I'm taking Espen. Yep, Espen's mine. Not taking my son. You didn't love him in the beginning. Leaving him with you. You broke his arm. Oh, I broke his arm. Okay. Stop holding that over my fucking head. I didn't just it hit him. I just accident. broke his arm. An accident. You've looked at me every day since, like I'm some kind of monster. I probably I'm am. Now, if you want a divorce, no. Espen is coming with me. You bitch. Please stop it. I give up. You can eat my child. I just don't want to see all these horrible things. Okay. She's lying. I never hit her or Espen. I swear, please. Silence. Sit down now. Oh, I'm a jerk. Find in favor of the plaintiff, Miss Dahl. She shall retain sole custody of her son, Ugh. Espen Dahl. The defendant shall have no visitation rights. Oh, I'm a jerk. I lied. Oh, I don't like her. Don't like her. Haven't liked her at all. Please, God damn it, let go of me. Don't. Please, don't take him away from me. Don't take him away from me. Don't take him away from me. Don't put her in her arms. Eric can have him. I can't. I don't want to see what comes next. Well, you should know what comes next, but I don't, so I'd love to see it. You should sit down. Oh, he killed himself, I bet. Or he died, one of the two. Your husband was found dead in his apartment. Yep, he killed himself after being framed for that. Probably lost all of his friends and his family. He probably lost his work and his job. Oh, not his work. He lost his work. He lost his job. But he never hurt me or the kid. It was all me. I wish I could take it back. It's the worst thing I've ever done. Yeah, you got that right. I did. I love my son, too. I love Sure, because that's why you broke his arm. I for love. I no idea his father would... That he... I made one terrible mistake and I ruined everything. Yep, sounds about I right. That's what happens. Myself. Are you happy now, you bitch? You horrible woman. Why you make me remember these things? The sun is starting to come up. I'm not going to make it. You're not gonna make it. Your son's gonna die. Well, it works. <laughs> Hard depression. I like the name of that achievement. Oh, boy. So, uh, we found out a lot about this woman and how much she actually loves her son. I mean, like, it depends on what was happening, but from what it looked like, they were just standing there, and then she was like, you know what? I'm tired of him whining about it, so she just snapped his arm. <laughs> what? <laughs> I thought she hit him, and I was like, oh, okay. Well, you know, like, I wouldn't condone it at all. You don't, like, hit a kid for that, but, you know, I can understand snapping and doing it, but no, breaking his arm? That's a bit excessive. There was something else going on there. Oh, hi. That looks beautiful. Okay, I'm just gonna go right on in here. Maybe I'm gonna die. Maybe that's what's gonna happen. My son's luring me up here, and I'm actually the sacrifice for some stuff. That's uh, not true. It's always children, but it would be fun. Go through here. Where's my kid? Is he dead? Does he be dead? Honestly, though, I think I'm better in this case. Death versus abusive mother. Depends on how abusive I've been over the years. Have I been better since that one time? Or have I been continuously abusive? See, this is the questions I want to know. Like, even after my husband died, was I still hurting that kid? And the fact that I convinced the court, see, that's just... I have my own opinion about women that lie on that. I, I just, I don't agree. I think it's disgusting. And there needs to be a better rights, equal rights, when it comes to the court system, especially for men. But that's my opinion. Be 
because so much stuff can be done against a guy. Not so much with a woman. I'm just gonna go through this ribcage. Oh, I'm gonna tickle some funny bones in here. Ha ha. I'm hilarious. No, I'm not. Don't, don't fool yourself. Ah, uh, yes, the child sacrifice as foretold by the giant rock. Yep, that looks good. He'll be fine. That doesn't look that bad. Screaming with your arms outstretched. Now that looks super duper good. All right, where do I go? I guess I keep going up. Okay. Did I go up? Did I come down? I don't remember. Holy Christ. Oh my God. The wolf is real. What wolf? What wolf? Was I supposed to see a wolf? Did I miss it? Did I miss something? I obviously missed something, because I don't see any wolf. I see a giant boat! That's about all I see. I don't see a wolf. The wolf is real! It's a boat. Oh, there's another dead... It's the same dead guy over and over again. Yep, there he is inside, too. Hi, dead guy. You, you seem to be hanging out with me a lot, traveling about on this quest. I enjoy the fact that you want to spend some time with me. See, you're even walking up the levels with me. I appreciate the company. I don't like being scared. Oh, oh, bleh. No, don't do it. Good. Alright, yep, I gotta go over. I gotta go on this. I don't know if I could do it. I'm gonna try. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah, lady. Walk normally. <laughs> Can't walk normally. I got weird legs. Where am I supposed to go? Where am I? Where am I? Uh, I really hate when I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Was I not supposed to walk over that? Did I just like break the game by doing the thing I thought I was supposed to do? But it really wasn't what I was supposed to do. Where, where are you going? Where am I going? Alright, I guess I'm gonna jump down here. I guess that's what I was supposed to do. Yep, that looks about right. I'm an idiot. Okay. Far from the course. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What is... Is that... Oh, is that what she meant was the wolf? Oh, that's literally its jaws. How do I... Where, woman, figure out a path and take it. <laughs> Those jaws are moving. You're taking your sweet butt old time trying to get somewhere. Am I going down again? Why am I going down? I want to go up. I want to go up in the world. God. Her and her legs. My ankles are broken. I can't figure out how to walk. Wow, those are some lovely teeth. That is one hungry thing. Don't make me push him again or something. Oh you gotta jump. Espen. Espen, look at well, me. I was running and now she's walking. I missed you too, little man. Please come away from the edge. No. No. Espen, oh, I don't have control. That's don't. what it is. <laughs> there are other children. It doesn't have to be you. There are tons of other kids. Shut you fucking coward. No, he doesn't. I love you. And I'm proud of you. You're very brave. But I don't want you to do this. Please. Please. I need you. He's gonna jump. And I'm proud of you too. Espen, no. Yep, he fell. Oh, and see? I accidentally killed the other guy too. So guess he's gonna take over that job. It's gonna be me! I'm gonna be killing all sorts of kids! I'm gonna break their arms and put them on my boat and ruin their husband's chances of success in life. That's how I'm gonna do it. I'm a horrible person. <laughs> oh, God. Espen. Espen. <laughs> he floats funny. <laughs> Up he dead! 
destroyed the world and stuff. So wait a minute. He gets eaten by the wolf, but his body gets spit out later, and he's just dead? I don't understand this. I'm a little Espen. confusical. Espen, please don't leave me. Oh, save Espen. Okay. No. E to save Espen. <laughs> Espen Press B to back. blow. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna break your ribs if you don't breathe. Come on. I'm gonna give you broken ribs Please. with that broken arm. Please. Boy, his face Please. is great. <laughs> like, <bleh. laughs> breathe. I'm just letting that other guy just drown over there. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to save my kid. Can I accept? Press Q to accept. Does something happen if I keep trying to save them? Is there an amount of times that I can just keep doing this? Like, does he come back to life if I just keep going? I'm curious of like if Q is the only option I got. Press Q to accept. Why not A to accept? Oh, okay. I think she just does it. Oh, no. She had to. No. Okay, we're accepting. I'm sorry. God, that face. I love you. I love you, too. I know I'm I supposed to be sad, that. but that face just ruined it for me. Goodbye. Be safe. In town halls and libraries. In hairdressers and bars are people who will never know what Espen did for them. What he did for all of us. The world moves on as it it's always has. Arrogantly, without a care. But it comes with a price. I couldn't save my marriage, and I couldn't save Espen, but he saved us. He protected all of us for a time. He was a little boy, my beautiful son, and I had to kiss him goodbye. I feel like my heart will never mend. He was better than me in every way I can think of. I don't know where he wanders or where he's going all alone, but wherever he is, I'm just... I'm so proud of him. I loved him so much, I ached. I love him still. Espen was my favorite thing. My best friend. And I lost him. We lost each other. And I don't know if I can forgive myself. But now, I can forgive Espen. I'm not going to pretend I was a good mother. But I raised a good son. Now, all I have to do is make sure his sacrifice meant something. Called it. I called it. I so called it. Like two episodes ago, I so called it. I knew she was going to accidentally kill that guy or kill him on purpose. And then she was going to take over his job. I so nailed that ending. I love when I do that. But, yeah, it's a, well, to me, that ending was kind of predictable, but I really enjoyed seeing it. It was really neat. I like the concept of, of that. Um, and, you know, honestly, I like Espen the most out of all the characters to a degree, because he was the most, he was like, I'm just going to accept the fact that I got to do this, and I'm just going to go do it. Why not? Um, I didn't really like her, and <laughs> especially when they were revealing the stuff about her, like, I'm gonna lie about my husband and get him arrested and make sure he can never see his son again and pretend that he's the one who broke his arm even though it was me you know that type of thing so but honestly I like the ending the game is okay to a degree I still have some beefs with it I really do um, but it's okay like they at least explained what was happening between here and the town and why um, he was able to go into this other world and get kids there, or the other dimension, and then bring them back to this dimension. So this is a completely different dimension than um, the world that Espen and his mom is from. 
So that made sense as to why all those people just couldn't get into boats and row away. Honestly, it's like, why well, doesn't everybody just get a piece of that crystal and row away and stuff? But if there was like only one piece that, or one little shattered piece that they found, and only one person can really use it and bring back a couple of people at a time, it makes sense, I guess. But I guess this is my thoughts on it. You know, now that I think about it, why not just put people in the boats individually and row them across and just stay in the other world? But you know, whatever. I don't write these things. I just think about it. So, um, trying to think if there was anything else that kind of stood out to me. Oh, right. And sometimes the game mechanics were just wonky. There was only two real areas I had a hard time getting through, and that was from the wolves and the lady with the flashlight issue. So those are the only two areas I had issues with. One was because I didn't understand what it was it was wanting me to do. And the other one was because the mechanics sometimes worked and sometimes it didn't. So <laughs> there are some areas in this game that are wonky, but for the most part, I enjoyed it. I would probably play something like it in the future. Um, but again, it's it's not it's not gonna be everyone's cup of tea. I like it more or less because of the story to a degree. I like the ending. Um, so I don't know. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. So I will check you guys later. You have a wonderful day and have a nice night. Check you guys later. Bye.